Center for Disability and Development, CDD, has been working in Bangladesh for more than two and a half decades to promote rights and dignity of persons with disabilities. From the very beginning, CDD has been working in different sectors for disability inclusion that includes inclusive education, health and rehabilitation, local government, disaster risk reduction, and livelihoods, humanitarian response, and so forth. CBD started implementing a three-year project titled Strengthening Resilience in South and Southeast Asia by Integrating Risk Management, Social Inclusion, and Socio-Economic Development at the Rayanda Union under Sharankola Sub-District in Bagarhat District, Bangladesh. The project is supported by Arbeiter Semrater Band ASB and started from November 2020. Rayanda Union is located at the southwestern coastal belt in Bangladesh and it is one of the most disaster prone areas in the country. In 2007, the devastating cyclone cedar caused huge damages in this area, including lives, assets, and infrastructures. Most of the people in Rwanda Union are poor and their livelihood options are limited. There are a significant number of persons with disabilities in Rwanda Union who are often excluded from the mainstream development planning and implementation. The objective of the project is an improved socio-economic development and resilience of disaster-prone communities in South and Southeast Asia through climate-smart and risk-sensitive livelihoods with greater involvement as well as leadership of women and persons with disabilities. To achieve its outcomes, the project implemented a number of interventions that include Number one, organizing a comprehensive project kickoff program. Number two, strengthening capacities of 44 government and non government stakeholders through providing different trainings. Number three, running awareness raising program on COVID 19 in the households of persons with disabilities. Number four, supporting persons with disabilities to access to COVID 19 vaccine. Number five, providing 50% contribution to install improved and environment-friendly cooking stalls in 300 households of persons with disabilities, ultra poor and destitute women. Number six, installing accessibility features into training venues of different government institutions. Number seven, raising community awareness on DI, DRR, and CCA through mock drill and Gombira song in nine public places through the engagement of trained volunteers and cultural groups. And number eight, observing the National Disaster Preparedness Day 2021 at Upojala level and making advocacy with concerned stakeholders on disability inclusion into disaster preparedness.